హలో నమస్తే కెన్ యూర్ ఆన్ ఆఫ్ వరుణ్ అండ్ అశోక్ సేమ్ పిన్ సో యూ లాస్ట్ హెయిర్ ఆర్ యూ జస్ట్ ఐ మీన్ యూ షేవ్డ్ ఆర్ యూ లాస్ట్ షేవ్డ్ ట్విన్నింగ్ మీ డోంట్ ట్విన్ సంబడి హెల్స్ వై డూ వాంట్ లూజ్ హెయిర్ ఎట్ దస్ సచ్ అ యంగ్ ఏజ్ హౌ ఓల్డ్ ఐ యూ ట్వంటీ ఎయిట్ డూ ఇట్ కమ్ ఆన్ మ్యాన్ ఐ యూ లూజింగ్ హెయిర్ నో రైట్ ఐ హోప్ సో బికాస్ ఐ స్టార్ట్ ఎట్ లూజింగ్ హెయిర్ ఎట్ టూ ఇయర్స్ ఓల్డ్ ఫ్రమ్ దెన్ ఆన్ ఇట్ నెవర్ యూ లైక్ యూ నో టీత్ ఫాల్ ఆఫ్ రైట్ హెయిర్ స్టార్ ఇట్ ఫాలోయింగ్ అప్ ఫ్రమ్ no no these days i'm stopping whenever somebody is taking a picture na no? i'm stopping and posing also because they are taking pictures but nobody is tagging me everywhere i don't know what they are doing with their in the night when they feel lonely they take a tag me somewhere somewhere ah uh, facebook instagram or could somewhere huh? yeah? this joke is only for people who are like 35 plus some people are like arkuta <laughs> arkud was like our facebook at that time it was so bad i mean we could have seen our future at that time you were part of arkud you are 28 dude you used arkud also that's why hair is gone <laughs> <laughs> and this is something i've been observing in all my shows uh, you know people keep saying hey you do clean comedy anyway so we are bringing kids <laughs> so like that how old is that kid four years thank you <laughs> how old is the other kid there was one kid there right ma'am yes. two years wonderful <laughs> is there anybody want to deliver now <laughs> we can facilitate that also i have seen three days i know how to do also <laughs> huh? <laughs> but thank you and in one show like this only four month old they got the baby we told him dude <laughs> we mentioned very clearly in uh, book my show that it is 16 plus and that guy like sir average age is 16 plus <laughs> leave re i don't want to do a show anymore uh, nonsense people man but thank you so much for turning up like there are like couple of rules for a stand up comedy show okay the first rule whenever performer asks a question na you should not raise your hand nod your head you have to cheer okay shameless fella <laughs> no no shamelessness is a very important quality which you need to have you know uh, especially for people who are data scientists in swiggy <laughs> huh? you are the data scientist you are the data scientist okay, okay fine how much you get paid <laughs> no no he made fun of swiggy but i like swiggy man <laughs> because we can order any time if i get bored i order swiggy and sometimes miracles happen one day the delivery guy he was like sir how are you <laughs> dude which video you have seen <laughs> sir i did not see the video this is the fourth time i am delivering to your house <laughs> the same guy dude enough re by mistake i told take picture that guy is taking in every angle <laughs> take now <notice. laughs> tag me on my ass raja mami danda <laughs> If you guys want like pictures without shirt and all I'll charge extra. <laughs> 5000. Huh? No, no, it's okay tell now. Now that you have come this far, you can tell whatever you want. <laughs> I didn't know even that choice is also there. That choice is also there. What? <laughs> you will take it if there is a If there is a service like that. You will take it, yeah? Why I'll come home only today. <laughs> You do whatever you want. Huh? What? Do take him with you. <laughs> yes, that service is all there. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So these are all jokes, okay? But even if you join Zomato, also we'll make fun of you. Only. <laughs> That way, comedians are very democratic. We are not biased. Huh? The only people who are biased and actual comedians are politicians. That's a different thing. <laughs> but uh, thank you so much like you guys have seen stand up comedy videos right yes, yes. Huh? who is your favorite comedian <laughs> for this only i am <laughs> i want to hear this 
in one show I asked like this only you, they should tell my name na na kenni kenni we love you kenni i don't even i love kenni <laughs> not like that sir <laughs> that girl i know i'll take his service today <laughs> There is service charge extra <laughs> plus GST. <laughs> not interested. Thank you. <laughs> Everybody is saying not interested. That way, my life is also democratic. Girls are also not interested. Boys are also not interested. Huh? So all of you came together, okay? Okay. How? How? What is the what is the scenario here? Like, how do you guys know each other? WhatsApp group. <laughs> your colleagues, friend. Okay. Wow. So you are combining everybody, kya? <laughs> which which company you guys are colleagues? Pioneer. Huh? Pioneer. What? Pioneer. What is that? Beyond Air. Pioneer. <laughs> Can you spell it? V. V e o n e e r. What is that? <laughs> what? what is, why is it so difficult to pronounce? How will T C S see how simple it is? <laughs> Three random letters. There is no meaning to it. Very easy to pronounce. That's why I don't join any company which is tough to pronounce. Okay, we whatever that is. So what do you guys do? What is your company into? Airbags. Oh, you produce airbags. Wow. My airbags are not my not my, not mine. <laughs> my vehicle. <laughs> sure. You, like what? Do you also have data scientists like that guy? What do you do? You just like balloon practice. What? <laughs> Uh, what is it? The end of the day, they are just like balloons only. Right? Just come on. Huh? We are R and D. Okay, how do you do research for airbags? Simulate, simulate the accident. Wow, wow! In real time. <laughs> you simulate the accident in real time. What? You remove the brakes of somebody's car. <laughs> Happy journey. <laughs> Good to know you. <laughs> <laughs> like real people drive or no, no, no. not the not actual car. Not simulate only the device. Simulate the device. Yeah. So how do you test it? Like it has to hit something, right? <laughs> what will it hit? We hit with we hit, we hit each other. <laughs> <laughs> you hit with hand. Uh. <laughs> Hello, when accident happens, <laughs> it's not. <laughs> like no, it never happens. Like you hit with the hand. Who are these airbags for lovers? <laughs> oh my baby might hit to the I'll wear an airbag here. And then like, oh bad. <laughs> so you hit with the hand. Hit me once. Airbags. <laughs> Cut here and put an airbag. Right? Now I just want to see how hard she is going to hit and also like. Okay, so I want to now everybody is curious. And there's a kids actually. <laughs> uh, you need to tell the truth. The kid already has a balloon. <laughs> that itself looks like an airbag. Show it to one, everybody. <laughs> what is the <that> toy though? <laughs> oh, that's a duck. <laughs> that's a duck, right? Yes. Okay, it floats also on the in the. Huh? <laughs> I love toys too. <laughs> uh, uh, not Peppa Pig. <laughs> So I think if I have any regrets in my life, now I think one of the regrets is making that video on Peppa Pig. Huh? You are from J P Morgan. That is another regret actually. Today I think all my regrets came to my show. Any of my ex lovers came here? No. no. Uh, I made that video of Peppa Pig. Okay, that's a mistake. I think. Because some people, you know, it feels good when somebody recognizes you, right? Some people they recognize me, but they cannot place the name. They don't know who I am. Okay, one guy saw me in uh, airport. They were like, <laughs> "Baby, who is this guy?" Hey, big guy. <laughs> Thank you. I shouldn't have made that. And my nephew is telling me that uh, Mama Peppa Pig is getting married. In one of the episodes, Peppa Pig is going to get married. It seems. And he was asking Peppa Pig is also getting married. <laughs> Hey, bakwas fellow. <laughs> now I don't know, man. Like it's just very. But I like toys. I mean, I mean, I went to Hamleys. Okay, so it's such a huge store, and I love Hamleys because the collection of toys mind blowing. Okay, and I, I feel like, dude, where are these toys when I was growing up? 
<laughs> you know, I asked when I was a kid, na, my aunt, I asked her, like, hey, give me a toy. She just broke the coconut, two pieces will be there, na. <laughs> she put three dots with her kajal, na. These are two eyes, this is a mouth. This is Barbie, play with it. <laughs> the, <laughs> now they have so many toys, okay. And my nephew, every year, I think, uh, like last birthday, I gave Peppa Pig, right? This time I don't want to make that kind of a mistake. I didn't want to give him a toy. So this year I took this Lego bricks, you know, na? I, I put a story. What? You're stalking me, can <laughs> You're also from Swiggy? No. Huh? I work with Razor Pay. Razor Pay? Dude, wow, what is this? All <laughs> uh, apps and all. Razor Pay, great man. VNR. <laughs> Whatever that is, you know. <laughs> they make airbags. <laughs> <laughs> we hit with hand. <laughs> that was the most amazing reply I have ever seen. I think you will lose your job. <laughs> you should apply for Razor Pay. <laughs> or maybe Swiggy. Uh, that guy will teach you data is a science. <laughs> you take our data, kya? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Everybody is stealing my data. Uh, Google is listening. Facebook is listening. Mark Zuckerberg is listening. Of course, what are they listening? Nothing only. I want to add a Rukma. What will he do with that data? <laughs> huh? But anyway, what, I was talking about something, right? Ah, toy. toy. Oh. <laughs> focus is very important in life. You have focus, right? Hmm? Nothing will happen to you. Nothing, no, no bad will happen to you. Unless some airbag <laughs> doesn't open. <laughs> Your company is Vionair. I'll make sure. I'll check the car. Uh, which company airbags are there? Vionair. I don't want it. Right? <laughs> Keep it with you only. <laughs> I have balloon. The duck balloon is there. <laughs> that will save me. <laughs> it will come and hit me. What the duck? <laughs> ah, where was I? Huh? Lego, yeah. So, you did not understand, ma'am? That orange color t-shirt, like, uh, you are asking that guy, no? What did you ask him? I'm explaining him. He did not. <laughs> Who are you, eh? You don't know Lego also? I Come here. Kids, huh? I don't have kids. Okay. You don't have kids? I'm not a parent. No. That, that doesn't explain anything. <laughs> you can have kids without getting married. <laughs> huh? So, how old are you? 24. You should play Lego. <laughs> Purchase him a Lego. How, how do you know her? How do you know him? He's my friend. Friend or boyfriend? Friend. Just friends. Yeah. You don't want to get into. Friend, no. You should not also. <laughs> Whoever doesn't play Lego, I don't think they should be in a relationship. Huh? You guys play Lego? Akka? You, you don't play Lego. You play with people's lives. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry. Yeah, that one. She abused me in Telugu. Yeah, that one, it seems. Thank you, same to you. <laughs> These days, if anybody is abusing, I'm telling them thank you. Same to you. <laughs> we are twins. <laughs> Okay, so like, uh, like we got almost come to the end of it. I have like a couple of, uh, uh, you know, improv games I want to play with you guys, okay? You know improv, right? Huh? What is improv? Tell me. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We'll ask the 24-year-old. Uh, what is improv? No, no. Dude, who are you? How can you be so ignorant, right? What, what's, your, what's your name? Harsha. Harsha, I think you should take tuitions. I will teach you. Sure. Huh? Uh, what did you do in uh, your education qualification? I'm a software engineer. Software engineer. Wow, which company? Wipro. <laughs> Induction me? <laughs> they did not tell you all this Lego, <laughs> improv. Corona bag. Corona bag. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's my fault I am expecting too much. She is also Corona bag. <laughs> How will you take share back? We slam. <laughs> Very delicately. <laughs> Amma, like this. <laughs> you will never come to my show, no? <laughs> so, uh, what we'll do is now, uh, we have, uh, we'll distribute like four chits. 
what i wanted to do is write anything which comes to your mind don't write in telugu don't write in hindi don't write peppa pig <laughs> don't give feedback about this show ha huh? just write ha huh? what a, any sentence sentence is a group of words okay which should end with a full stop okay wonderful ha uh, see every time you open your mouth you are decreasing your chances of getting married or getting into relationship that's good na no? that's good for you good for sorry good for the girls actually <laughs> ma'am good choice i'm proud of you i think you are very clear about what qualities you don't want in a person <laughs> Okay, write any sentence, uh, one sentence, and give it back to me. Write it in English and give it back to me. So how this is going to work is, I'll start telling a story, and in middle of the story, whatever sentence you write, na, that will I'll open randomly, and that will become part of the story. Okay, what kind of a story you want to listen to? Horror. Give me the genre. Horror. Horror is uh, Swiggy. Romantic drama. Huh? Romantic what? <laughs> Romantic drama. Wow. Do it. When you get romantic, it will be drama only. <laughs> For the girl, it will be melodrama. <laughs> okay, we'll take romantic drama. That's like a two genres he mixed. It's like almost liger, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll tell a story, which is a romantic drama. Okay, we'll see where it goes. Cool. Okay, when every now and then I'll open some shit. Whatever is written, that will become part of the story. Okay, but for me to start, you guys have to give a round of applause. Then we'll start. Okay? <laughs> A long long ago there was a boy who doesn't know anything he was the most ignorant person in the world somehow luckily he made friends with a girl who used to explain him everything even then they never found a spark between themselves and that guy started becoming more and more dumb every time he opened his mouth the girl would be like please shut up and there was one time after the guy begging her for a long time the girl agreed to go on a date they went to starbucks and the moment coffee was given to him he opened the mouth and he looked at the girl and told her get married soon <laughs> i don't want you to go through me every time i am not eligible for you i am not qualified to marry you i am just a loser and the girl said yes correct <laughs> for the first time your awareness is working but before we leave i want to give you an advice please follow this advice no matter what happens and the girl looked at him with lot of kindness she told him i want to get married this year hopefully <laughs> now that both of them have agreed to marry <laughs> the girl started searching for somebody the boy asked hey i'll find the right guy for you whom do you want to marry and that girl said maybe some data scientist <laughs> because i like data i like science too and with data and science mix it will be an art and then the boy said hey i know one data scientist he works for swiggy probably i'll talk to him and the guy immediately called the swiggy guy and he asked hey hey is there a girl do you want to marry this girl and the swiggy guy replied to him sky is blue blood is red <laughs> and for the first time that guy realized all his friends are also dumb like him <laughs> the girl realized i think for me to get married the best thing i have to do is i should not hang out with all these dumb people <laughs> and then she told him with lot of kindness again hey i don't think you or any one of your friends are going to get married in this life i think you should just get a job right here in starbucks i think you should become a waiter and the guy said yes i will become a waiter anyway at wipro also i'm doing the same thing <laughs> I'm waiting for promotion. I'm waiting for project. I'm waiting for the HR. And the girl said, "Okay, fine, join here." And the guy went to the counter of the Starbucks. And there's a lady standing there at the counter. He asked, "Hey, can I get a job?" The lady looked at this guy and told him, "Bangalore has a lot of traffic." <laughs> okay, that's the story. Can we have a round of applause for all of you, man? Thank you. Hey, sorry, huh? we did not. We did not feel bad, right? I know. <laughs> Just clarifying, okay. <laughs>